Hello, Outlander fans. Welcome to my channel, where I analyze every episode of the Hit Stars series based on Diana Gabaldon's novels. Today, I'm going to talk about the mid-season finale of Outlander Season 7, Episode 8, titled, Turning Points. This episode was packed with action, drama, romance, and some major twists that will have huge implications for the rest of the season and beyond. If you haven't watched the episode yet, be warned. There are massive spoilers ahead. So, without further ado, let's dive into it. Before continue, I request you to subscribe our channel and press on the bell icon button for new videos notifications on time. The episode starts with Claire finding Jamie on the battlefield, barely alive after being shot in the hand and losing a lot of blood. She manages to save him and bring him back to their tent, where she stitches his wound and gives him some laudanum to ease the pain. Jamie tells her that he was trying to save William, his biological son, who was fighting on the British side. He also reveals that Colonel Johnson praised him for his bravery and leadership during the battle. This scene shows us how much Claire and Jamie love each other and how they are willing to risk everything for each other. It also sets up the conflict between Jamie and William, who are on opposite sides of the war and have different views on loyalty and honor. Jamie wants to protect William from harm, but he also wants him to join the American cause or at least stay out of the fight. William, on the other hand, feels bound by his duty to his king and his country, but he also respects Jamie as a father figure and a warrior. Meanwhile, in 1981, Roger and Buck return to Lallybrock with the bad news. Rob Cameron, Brianna's co-worker who discovered their time-traveling secret, kidnapped Jem and took him through the stones. Roger decides to go after them and asks Brianna to stay behind with Buck and Mandy. Brianna is reluctant, but agrees to let Roger go. They share a tearful goodbye at Crane and Dunn, where Roger promises to find Jem and come back to her. This scene shows us how much Roger and Brianna love each other and how they are willing to risk everything for each other. It also sets up the conflict between Roger and Rob Cameron, who are both descendants of Dougal Mackenzie and Jillis Duncan. Rob Cameron wants to use Jem's blood to travel through time and change history for his own benefit. He also knows about Buck Mackenzie, who is actually Jillis Duncan's son from the future. Roger wants to stop Rob Cameron from messing with the timeline and save Jem from his clutches. Back in 1777, young Ian asks Claire if there will be another battle soon. She confirms that there will be, according to history. The Battle of Saratoga is about to happen, and it will be a turning point for the American Revolution. Claire also warns Ian that William might be in danger, since he is still with the British Army. Ian decides to go look for him and try to convince him to switch sides or at least stay out of harm's way. This scene shows us how much Ian cares about William as his cousin and friend. It also sets up the conflict between Ian and Rachel Hunter, Denzel's sister and his love interest. Rachel is a Quaker who opposes violence and war. She also loves Ian and wants to be with him. Ian is a Mohawk who embraces fighting and adventure. He also loves Rachel and wants to be with her. At the British camp, William is having second thoughts about his loyalty. He sees the brutality and cruelty of his fellow soldiers who torture and kill innocent civilians and rebels. He also witnesses the incompetence and arrogance of his commanding officers who ignore the advice of their scouts and allies. He remembers Jamie's words about fighting for a cause he believes in, not for a king he doesn't know. This scene shows us how William is conflicted about his identity and his role in the war. He is torn between his upbringing as a British aristocrat and his heritage as a Scottish outlaw. He is also influenced by Jamie's example as a man of honor and courage. The next day, the battle begins. The British are outnumbered and outsmarted by the Americans, who use guerrilla tactics and ambushes to inflict heavy casualties on them. William tries to fight bravely, but he is soon wounded by a musket ball in his leg. He falls to the ground and sees Jamie running towards him. Jamie reaches him and carries him to safety while dodging bullets and bayonets. This scene shows us how Jamie risks his life to save William from death or capture. It also shows us how William recognizes Jamie as his father and trusts him with his life. Meanwhile, Ian finds Rachel Hunter among the American camp followers. She tells him that she came to help her brother with the wounded soldiers. She also confesses that she loves Ian and wants to be with him. They share a passionate kiss and decide to run away together after the battle. Thanks for watching, please like, share, 